Okay, one of the things that's been asked for in the um, training we've done is on a mobile phone or a smartphone, how to play music. How do you play music? So how do you go about doing this? Okay, first of all, be able to play music on a phone. Generally, but not always, you need to have the actual music on your phone. And the music is in the f form of MP3 files. Talk about that later on if someone wants to email me, ask me about it. Okay. Um, so you've got to get the, your files onto your computer. Then you actually need an application that allows you to play the music. So there are heaps of the internet that will allow you to play music. One that I've downloaded is simply called Music Player, which is down here, as you can see. Okay, so uh, all I do is tap on my Music Player app, and there we are. It opens it up. Um, when I open it up, this one... And every single music player will be different about so the way you do things. I can look at albums, I can look at artists, I can look at songs, I can look at folders, I can look at genres, I can look at mini tracks, lots of things. Okay, so if I just go to um, uh, recent, for example, uh, and play something, touch it. Yeah, it's playing. To stop playing it, I just press the pause button. Oh, not to stop playing, to pause it, I press the pause button. If I want to stop playing it. I don't know how I do that. <laughs> I think you press, there's a stop button somewhere. Up the top, down the top here probably when the music's playing. No, it's not there. Okay. Oh, yes, it is. And that's the recorder that I'm recording at the moment. Okay, so that's that's basically how it works. Um, there's lots of options within it. And that's one way of playing music. Uh, another way of playing music is if you've already got, which I'll just come out of that. And by the way, when you're playing music, um, a music player will continue to operate no matter what other application you're using other than probably when you want to you know, use a speaker for something else like when you're in a phone call it'll just interrupt the music you're in the phone call when you finish the music starts playing again if you go into file manage which I've got on my phone you can is also another way of playing the music is simply to go into the files where your music is and then just use that same app to play it so I've got a, an SD card here and I've got a folder called music all right Here's my music. I've got six fab folders. My wife's favourites. Uh, I want to play that one. I just play it. It says what application you want to open it with. And I've got more. I'm just going to use this one and say I just want to do this just once. So I do that. And there we are. Um, and it starts playing in a second. Okay. Okay, if you want to go to another one, just touch it. Where is it? Where is that one? Okay, that's basically it. All right, that's how easy it is to play music. The next question I'm going to get from people is, how do I get music to put on my phone, or how do I put the music on my phone? I've already done another uh, video, a video that shows you how to get the files off photos from your computer to your phone, you should use the opposite procedure to get it from your computer to your phone. And so you can copy all your music from your computer to your phone. To get the stuff from CDs onto MP3 files, that's another uh, situation again, so that you can actually have them off your CDs onto your phone. Uh, if you want that, send me an email and I'll produce a video that shows you how to do that if you want to. And that'll be a computer video though. Okay, any questions, email me. Bye.